Hello everyone, I'm Luke Rains. I'm Kelsey Sullivan. And, and you're, you're watching, watching The Sting. This next week will be Thanksgiving break, so everybody get ready. Hmm. And uh, yesterday was JTG's Thanksgiving lunch, and everything seemed to look delicious. And be sure to check out a quick sports short from last football game on Williamson County Television on the YouTube channel. And there's a link in the description below. The faculty is still selling chocolate bars to raise money for general admissions around the school, so make sure to get a chocolate bar from any one of your teachers. The Veterans Assembly last week was a huge success, and we'd like to thank all the veterans who attended, as well a special thank you to First Sergeant Turk and all of JRTC, as well as Mr. Barr and all the band for their attendance. They truly did such a great job with the assembly. Yes, they did. And now here is Sports with Tannis. Hello? Oh, hi. And welcome to Sports with Tannis. I'm your host, Tannis Beek. We have an exciting next few weeks of, of sports. You know, even though we're on Thanksgiving break, it doesn't really matter. We're still going to be sportsing it up. On Tuesday the 21st, we're going to be going against Nashville Christian at home for basketball. We've already beat them once at their home, so we're looking for another W. And on the 25th, we have wrestling. Um, it's going to be against Father Ryan, no, at Father Ryan, versus FRA, NBA, Arlington, and Dixon. And on Thanksgiving break, on the 28th, on Tuesday, we have basketball at Summit. And uh, we've heard they're going to be pretty good competitors, but I have faith in our boys and girls that we're going to get some solid wins on both ends. Um, and on the 30th, Thursday, we have wrestling at Cheatham. And it's going to be against Creekwood High and Creekwood Middle, but it's going to be at home. December 1st, we have a game on Friday against CPA basketball, and it's going to be at CPA. Uh, that's going to be a tough one, but basketball has been working really hard, and I have faith in them. December 2nd, Saturday, we have wrestling against Harpeth, and it's going to be the individual tournament. It's going to be from 8 to 9. So there it is. Sports is going to be exciting for the next two weeks, and even though we're on break, we should get as many people out there as possible and support our jackets both for wrestling and basketball. See y'all later. Back to you guys. Thank you, Tannis. And now here is the MVP of the week. Okay, Mario, so I know you do wrestling. Um, what titles do you hold from last year? Well, I hold the two-time state qualifier and one-time regional champion. So what are your goals for this next season? This next season, we got put into a new division, so hopefully I, I will be the new regional champion for District 7. How do you think your team as a whole is going to do this year? I think our team will do well this year. Our only main competition will be Harpeth, and we have beaten them previously. Um, last year we did face Paige, and now they got moved into a bigger division, so this year we should end up on top. Thank you. Congratulations, y'all. We're very proud of you. And now here are some Thanksgiving themed lunchtime interviews. What does Thanksgiving mean to you? Uh, lots of food, lots of family, and mashed potatoes. Um, well, I've never celebrated Thanksgiving since I'm from Spain, but it means like eating a lot, that's what I heard. I think it's the, um, what we call Dia de Acción de Gracias, which is like you eat turkey, in November is in November, and all the families together, and you celebrate something about the Irish people or something like that. Well, it means family coming together and having a lot of fun and eating food. What was served on the first Thanksgiving? Maize, uh, beans, like corn and beans and squash, squash, and like a turkey. Uh, food, chicken, turkey, potatoes, mm, um, fish, and bread. Probably turkey, but I, I could be wrong. All right, who ate together on the first Thanksgiving? 
the Native Americans and the Pilgrims. Um, the Indians and I think people from England. Irish people and American people. Oh, that would be the white people and the not white people. What year was the first Thanksgiving? Uh, like 1537. Uh, 1885. A long time ago. Where did the pilgrims land when they got to America? Uh, Plymouth Rock. Yeah. On America? On Tennessee. The pilgrims? What is that? I don't even know what that means. Oh, that was... Uh, Massachusetts. Why did the Pilgrims come to America? Um, because they were separatists and they wanted to establish a new church. Because they were, because they wanted to leave in America. Because they didn't have space in Ireland. <laughs> um, to discover America. What was the boat called that the Pilgrims came on? The Mayflower. The was it like the Santa Maria and like the Nina? I don't know. The June bag. I have no clue. The Mayflower. Mayflower. Oh, I know this one. That's, um, I don't know. You could ask me any other day, I would have known. The May. Flower. All right, thank you. <laughs>